okay so now today try to understand how to multiply the two matrix two square matrices suppose here we are having matrix a and matrix b and it is two by two matrix that is there is there are two rows and two columns this is the first row this is the second row this is the first column and this is the second column so it is two by two matrix similarly matrix b is also a two by two matrix now we have to multiply these two matrices so in this case the matrix multiplication is obtained by multiplying these rows to the column keeping the same row to the another column second row first column and second row and second column so let us try to understand how the matrix multiplication is done now suppose we click on this particular cell then what we will have over here is now we have to keep this row correct so this is r1 and this is c1 of the another matrix so 1 into 12 plus 2 into 2 so this is kept in this particular this is put in this particular formula so this is a5 that is nothing but 1 into d5 that is nothing but 12 then this 2 is nothing but b5 multiply by d6 that is this particular element so 1 into 12 that is 12 plus 2 into 2 that is 4 so it is 16 so this is the first part of our matrix multiplication similarly keeping the same row you have to multiply this r1 to the second column so what are the elements element 1 is nothing but a5 multiply by e5 this is e5 element that is 1 into 5 then 2 into 9 so 2 is nothing but b5 b5 is 2 multiplied by e6 that is this particular element so it is 1 into 5 that is 5 plus 2 into 9 that is 18 so 18 plus 5 that is 23 similarly for this element so 3 into 12 that is nothing but a6 into d5 plus 4 into 2 that is b6 into d6 this is a d6 element so 3 into 12 that is 36 plus 4 into 2 that is 8 so 36 plus 8 that is 44 similarly for this element you have to multiply this second row and the second column so 3 into 5 that is 15 plus 4 into 9 that is 36 36 plus 15 that is 51 so you can see over here so this is a6 into e5 e5 is nothing but this element so second row and second column we are multiplying then b6 into e6 that is this element so that multiplication is 51 now using excel we can do these calculations very fast so suppose we go to the formulas in the math function you have to search for matrix multiplication select the array 1 over here so array 1 is nothing but this particular matrix first matrix click over here and select the matrix p that is this particular matrix so you can see the element it has given already this multiplication 1623 so 1623 which we have already obtained and then 4451 so 4451 so in this way you can multiply this 2 by 2 matrix now we'll go for 3 by 3 matrix suppose this is first row second row third row this is first column second column and third column similarly for matrix b this is the first row second row and third row this is first column second column and third column so this element can be obtained that is this 58 can be obtained by r1 and c1 then this element can be obtained keeping the rows same you have to multiply these elements 
corresponding elements and then add them together this is r1 and this is the c3 row c3 column that we have to take into consideration so suppose we start with this 58 how we have obtained this 58 so this first row and first column so 10 into 2 that is nothing but a22 into e22 a22 is this and e22 is 2 similarly plus b22 that is this multiplied by this element plus 4 multiplied by 6 that is c22 into e24 so let us try to understand once again this row we have to keep it as it is so this row means what what are the elements over here this is a22 b22 c22 and you have to multiply this element to the corresponding e 22 23 and 24 so a22 into e22 that is 10 into 2 plus 2 into 7 plus 4 into 6 so that will get 58 similarly for this element keeping this first row same you have to multiply these elements so 10 into 3 plus 2 into 6 plus 4 into 4 right? so that again you will get the value as 58 so what is this 10 element is nothing but a22 what is this 3 it is nothing but f22 plus sign b22 that is this element 2 you have to multiply to this 6 that is f23 that is this element plus c22 that is this element you have to multiply to the f24 that is this element so that addition of these multiplications will give you the answer 58 now for this element again keeping the row same you have to multiply to this column so 10 into 4 plus 2 into 3 plus 4 into 3 so again you will get what 58 so what is this 10 it is nothing but a22 multiply to this 4 means g22 plus b22 that is this element multiply to this 3 that is nothing but g23 that we have written over here plus 4 is nothing but c22 plus g24 that is this element so that you will get the multiplication for this first row of the multiplication over here similarly you have to do the calculations for the next element for example 77 will be nothing but second row and first column so 20 into 2 plus 1 into 7 plus 5 into 6 that will give the value of 77 this 86 can be obtained by keeping the row same you have to multiply to this column so 20 into 3 plus 1 into 6 plus 5 into 4 you will get 86 similarly this 98 can be obtained by keeping the row same you have to multiply to this third column so 20 into 4 plus 1 into 3 plus 5 into 3 that is 98 similarly for this 35 now you have to go to the third row and multiply this to the first column elements corresponding elements and add them together so 2 into 2 plus 1 into 7 plus 4 into 6 that will give the value of 35 this 28 can be obtained keeping this row same again multiply to this element so 2 into 3 that is 6 plus 1 into 6 that is also 6 plus 4 into 4 that is 16 so it is 6 plus 6 plus 16 so that is nothing but 28 and keeping the row same you have to multiply to this third column so that we will obtain this element 23 so 23 can be obtained by 2 into 4 plus 1 into 3 plus 4 into 3 so that will give the value of 23 so 2 into 4 that is 8 plus 1 into 3 that is 3 8 plus 3 that is 11 plus 4 into 3 that is 12 so 11 plus 12 that is 23 so in this way you can do the matrix multiplication but by using excel we can find out this value very easily so again go to the math function go to the matrix multiplication over here now select our first array that is nothing but this particular one like this click over here select the second array in this fashion select this matrix p and then you can see we have obtained this matrix p 
58, 58, 58. That is this first row. Then 77, 86, 98. 77, 86, 98. That is the second row of matrix multiplication. And 35, 28, 23. 35, 28, 23. So in this way, you can do the matrix multiplication effectively for square matrix using Microsoft Excel.